Alright, so we're going to be talking about Amanda and this is the part one because it's really slow. I'm not, I'm not sure I'm going to be able to upload this, but if I can, if I can't, then I will. I've done this for nothing. Great. But um, I might do more information, but my net, my internet is really slow because I can't afford good things. But anyway, Amanda. Alright, it means gladdening, but it's generally referred to as where Hindus uh, go to worship a god in the form of uh, various different deities, like like god goddesses or idols and stuff. Uh, Murtis help them to do this. Uh, Murtis are marble images uh, filled with the heavenly pres presence of God. Uh, they are daily worshipped with five, I'm going to pronounce this one, but artists and other ceremonies. I'm reading from a sheet because I can't remember it off by heart. Um, by doing this I'll be able to think about people from different, how people from different like religions and different beliefs, how they think and how they do stuff differently to you and I. So in, let's talk about what's inside of Mandir. So inside of Mandir you'll see lots of murtis and shrines because this will be respectful because it shows that you worship the god or goddess and you need to treat the god or goddess nicely so you could do this by giving them incense, water, fruit and flowers the Murti would normally be of uh, the god Ganesh and you would normally um, you would worship every day and they normally worship on a holiday called Ganesh Chatterthai festival. I probably pronounced that wrong, but oh well. Now, Hindu worship or puja involves images such as Murtis, prayers, mantras, and diagrams of the universe. Yantras. So that's that's the image that I found, and I'm, the image, the information is so late, and I might do some more information if I can get this to upload because it's so slow blah 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 thank you